All right, Lysorn here. So, sorry I haven't uploaded videos in a while. Um, got over a cold and did, also did a lot of business travel. So, this is really the first time I've had an opportunity to do any recordings with a halfway decent voice. I'm about somewhere between 90 to 95% healed with respect to my voice. And what we're doing today is we are doing Dawnbreak, the original game. Flaming Emperor, and I wanted to record uh, this week's um, guild raid. Obviously, our um, boss here is a dark element. We've got a, a mixture of heroes here in um, Omega Team Two. I'm running Santa Slut Astrid, and it looks like we've got uh, somebody's running Lawrence. That's Blas. I think is Blas running Lawrence. Cortex is running Clara. And F Sport is running. Uh, who's he running? Oh yeah, so he's running the other uh, light hero. So we got a good mixture of heroes here. And I'm just recording this so we can see uh, how much damage we're doing. Meanwhile, I'm trying to log into a client site using their stupid Citrix retriever receiver, and it's not liking my SSL certificate, which just annoys the crap out of me. It means I'm going to have to call their help desk. Not looking forward to that. Checking client. Oh, this is frustrating. Meanwhile, looks like uh, Blaz Lawrence is uh, throwing some occasional shields my way. We, uh, the, by the way, this is run number two of five, and based on the damage we're doing, we should be able to kill this boss today. Excuse me, boss. I I think I'm going to have to take your stapler. All right, how are we doing? Right, I'll put this on pause while we wait for the group to finish assembling. Okay, we are assembled. And let's go. Seconds. All right. All right. We're going to kill this boss in the next run here. So look forward to that. 
Sorry, I'm a little tired, so my voiceover is probably not going to be very interesting today. Again, I'm mainly doing this so you can see the numbers pop up and make your own judgment as to the type of damage we're doing. And I realized, you know what I need to do? I need to get some more coffee. So far, so good. No disconnects. That's a good thing. I have triumphantly returned with a mug of coffee. My day is going to go much better now. Oh. Nothing like a good old cup of Folgers. You know, I, I really dislike Starbucks. Um, as someone who used to live in Seattle, I know that's probably sacrilegious. But I just find the stuff too bitter for my taste. So, I travel a lot for work, and about half the hotels that I stay at will have Starbucks coffee. Whether it be, you know, the, you know, the two packets that they leave in the room with your little uh, the one cup at a time brewing machine. And every time I see it, I cringe. It's like, okay, i got to make sure i got some creamer or something, because it's just, you know, normally I take my coffee black. What? Oh, we just finished, yay. I'm like, why, why are we ending? Okay. That's right, we just killed it. Shouldn't have killed it, poor little feller. He was just a boy. Mm -hmm. You shouldn't be talking about that boy. Mm -hmm. I knew a little bit of sling blade. All right. On to the next boss. We're now on boss nine. What is today? Tuesday. We're doing pretty good. Yeah, so it's inter and one of the reasons why I want to record, especially as the week progresses, we had, a, we had a very interesting bug that we hit on Sunday. So, on Sunday, we were fighting Boss 10. And um, Cortex here has been playing consistently every day of the week. I actually missed one day because I was traveling, so I didn't get all the points. Um, but Cortex and F-Sport and Blah have been raiding pretty consistently. And um, X-Cortex in particular has been really racking up the points. And what we discovered on Sunday is Cortex has now become so powerful that he actually broke the game. <laughs> I kid you not. He... Um, we discovered that they are, I don't know if it's how they're storing it internally or how they're rendering it in the interface, but somewhere along the way, the developers are using what's called a signed 32-bit integer to represent the damage that has been accumulated in the boss rate. And what happened is that in a signed 32-bit integer, that the maximum number you can store in that variable is 2.147 billion. And X Cortex actually accumulated more damage points in the week than that number, and it caused his damage score to, to be shown. It actually reverted back to negative 2.147 billion, and then he accumulated a few more points, and that started to get him closer up to zero. So I went ahead and I logged a bug on Facebook um, on the developers page. Now, they may not see it for a few days because they're still um, they're at the tail end of, of celebrating the Chinese um, or the Lunar New Year. And every year around this time, the country of China pretty much shuts down. Like all the factories shut down. Everybody kind of goes back to their home villages for their celebrations. And the celebration may, may take a week to 10 days. But you have... Um, a lot of the workers in China, um, they're going to take rail from their village back to their the city where they work. 
And so that seven to ten day celebration actually takes a little bit longer because you have to account for the workers transit time from their office or warehouse or wherever it is that they work to the um, to their villages and then of course back again so it actually gets closer to be like a 10 day period at least 10 to 12 days so maybe a few more days before they see it so anyway we are now at what are we at 882 million um, and we're only on Tuesday so we are on track to break the game again um, so I anticipate by maybe maybe Saturday. I don't know if we're gonna hit it on Friday or not, but for sure Saturday or Sunday we're gonna hit the two two billion, and we're gonna break the game. So anyway, I'm gonna shut this thing down. Peace.